All right, we're gonna go over our plays now for a river and lake formation. Um, we'll just go over a river to, to the right. Um, I think it all makes sense. We go lake. So here we go, boys. River. We are spread. So the nice thing I really like about river and lake, there's not a lot of things a defense can do. Um, right tackles. You're gonna have a corner on each side. All right, gotta have a free safety, 10 yards off. Um, they're gonna have to have a cover hand. We got two linebackers left, so we're gonna have to have a linebacker here, which I call a monster. All right, I'm gonna call this guy, he's probably gonna be here, linebacker. All right, so just so you know, like my terminology, I call this guy the monster, kind of strong safety. Uh, he's the guy who will come out and cover, you know, a number two who's a linebacker slash defensive back kind of kid. So there's not a lot of other stuff they can do here that makes sense. We're gonna get the same defense every time. So our base play. Uh, this like last year is called Superman. So we're going to use again motion. So we'll go, let's say to the right, Superman right. This kid's going to go in motion. And when he goes in motion, when the ball snap, we want him, his aiming point is behind the guard. All right. Uh, let's try the timing of the motion. Down, ready, ready, set, so hit on the R and ready. Have him go fast. We're going to go kind of late and fast. Um, it's going to be his job to get here. Some kids who are a little faster can wait a little bit. Some slower kids maybe need to go earlier. Uh, we'll kind of figure that out. But we want to have, you know, they're about four yards, three or four yards away. We got some um, momentum so we can get out here as fast as possible. He's got a stud here who just beats this block up. All right. So we're there um, going this way. Quarterback's going to get the snap or blocking. We're going to keep it simple, right? We're going to drive block, drive block, okay? Our center is going to double team here. It'll make sense later. Now, I'll tell you what, he sees that, that motion. He's going to be out here. There's no way this kid's going to snap the ball. He's not going to be able to get a piece of him. That's just, I, I, I really doubt it. So we're going to, this is going to be fun. I really like what we're going to do here. Then we just got our perimeter blocking, right? We're going to stalk. Come up, fuzz our feet, mirror. Okay, you just gotta be better than those guys. One on one, see who wants it more. All right, we're gonna come here, we're gonna mesh. Quarterback is gonna um, reach the ball out. We want to reach the ball here. We don't wanna just put the ball straight out. All right, we wanna get the eyeballs. So we're gonna reach on your left hip. We're gonna ride it, okay? Put reach, ride, and then finish. After he gets the handoff, our L, right, we want him to bubble a little bit to get around this block, this penetration, right? Especially if we get a stud if he just does this and gobbles him up right away. It's not fun. So he's got to run this kid, outrun this kid. So he's going to bubble and we're going to call it running the hump. We want to get the ball here. Ideally, we want to get the ball outside and up the numbers. That's the goal. We want every time, that's his mindset. I'm going to get to the, the numbers in the sideline every time. All right, uh, so running the hump, like one thing we'll have is, is cones where he stays outside. It's like, it's like this hump over here. We don't want kids that get lazy and just right away turn it up. All right, that's plan B, obviously, but we want them thinking of run the hump, stretch it out, get away from these two guys. All right, this guy is probably just going to get the heck out of there. All right, it's a, it's a race. He's got to beat him. All right, we have to have fast kids in their slots in this formation. All right, quarterback, here comes the fun part. We're gonna read this kid, all right? He's gonna give the ball every time unless this kid's just on the motion getting out of there. So in a, on a handoff, if he does give it, all right, he's going to fake the quarterback run inside, all right? Now, after a couple times we run this, he can either have the quarterback read it if he's really good, or you can call it, hey, we're gonna call it, this will be keep, Superman right keep, hey, Johnny keep it this time. Or we're gonna just have Superman right read and have him read it. So if this kid's out of here, this kid's probably, if we're good at this play, he's gonna be getting there and trying to help out, right? Boom, there's nobody home. We get a double team on this guy. This guy's probably gonna try to fight to get out there. We got a huge alley. So we can get our kids to read this, and it's an easy read, he's, he's just four yards away. All right, pull it out, run the A gap. All right, 
So that's Superman. That's her base play. All right, that's our bread and butter, boys. We want to be great at this play. The other nice thing is we can run the exact same play to the left. I mean, I like it better to the left because there's only one guy to block. We work out to count on two blocks. If we run Superman, river Superman left, right? We do the same thing the other way. You can only got one block out there and a whole lot of space. So I really like running this to the weak side. So the complementary is complementary plays. So work gets fun, boys. It's a system that's just running a bunch of plays. And the monster is out here. Corner, corner, three. All right, so some things we'll start to do. You see that motion? These guys are going to get aggressive. All right, so we'll run Superman pass right. Superman pass right. This guy is just going to blow by him. Okay, if we get this hard here, I mean, it's just the easy. It's, again, we want to throw verticals for touchdowns. All right, this is going to be easy pass for these kids. Again, if this guy's coming down, we're not getting a lot of free safety support. Uh, we're going to have this guy do is climb and run our pigtail or whip, a whip out. Okay, so if this guy happens to be soft and bail, you still have a lot of room to run this out over here. Now, we're not going to mesh. Our slot backer, L, is going to do his part. He's going to get big. He's going to sell it getting low. Or he's going to fake it. He's going to bubble, and he's going to run a flare, which might be pretty sweet. Our quarterback, again, no match. He's going to get the ball. He's going to take his three-step drops. One, two, three, read in the corner. He's going to throw a touchdown every single time, unless for some reason this guy stays soft, and then we have our, our pigtail up. Probably would not have him read. I think mean, our kids reading a bunch of like, you know, see, that's one to throw the football, but uh, this would probably be a coach. Hey, hey, this time when Superman pass right, I want you to hit the, the, the flare. All right, man, man, if, if this thing might be wide open, that might be a touchdown too. So that's like a, maybe a special play we can run. All right, so if we're getting hard corners of monsters, uh, that is an answer. And we'll have to make a pay for it. Another one. Again, we want to have answers for the basic defensive adjustments. If they start doing crazy stuff, we've got to be able to make them pay. All right, so we start doing the motion. Another adjustment is having this guy, right, man up, follow him, and, and try to get over and help out, which is nice because now we have all that. So we're going to call this Joker. It's kind of like a counter slash reverse. Um, Gonna run it. We're gonna run our Superman. He's gonna, right? Instead of bubbling, he's gonna run flat. All right. And this one, we're gonna have him just climb. All right. Instead of the regular Superman, he's gonna do something different. He's gonna take a step back, and we're gonna get a double handoff. And it should be quick. It's not. It's gonna. It's in between a counter and reverse. We're going to call it Joker, right? It's like, a, they're going to go all this way. We're going we're gonna to fool him and come back. Our quarterback, after there's a handoff, he's going to be our pooler. He's going to come down here and pick up whoever shows up first. The most dangerous man. Handoff, handoff. All right, he's going to, after he hands off, fakes like he has it. This kid just will try to cut off the free safety in case he get a cut back. We could also run, you know, Superman right, Joker left keep or he'd keep it right so superman right joker left when this guy's just getting the heck out of there okay so it's kind of our superman package again we could also run superman left joker right we could also run superman right joker left special all right it's like the philly special he could this guy the quarterback could go up for a pass he could pull up so that would be Superman right, Joker left, special. So that is one of our explosive plays. So base play, complementary play, explosive play. All right. So some other stuff we can do on River Lake. Again, I think this is going to be fun for the kids. This is going to be fun for them to work on this. So we have some more passing stuff. Same as last year, Ninja. Now, if you have a right-handed quarterback, ninja's easier to the left. So we'll be in lake. Lake for this one. 
of our defense. Monsters on this side now, corner, corner. Or we'll call it ninja choice. If this guy's soft, our right, ninja means like it's a nail pass. All right, he's just gonna take one step up and come back here. All right, we're gonna take it, fall. Quarterback doesn't worry about finding the strings. You gotta be like a ninja throwing a ninja star. You gotta fiddle around and find the laces. This is like turning a double play. Quarterback's gonna take the ball, flip his hips. As he's flipping his hips, he's gonna turn and throw. A strike, he's gotta throw it downhill fast. We wanna throw the ball to his upfield shoulder so he can catch it and get vertical right now. Now this guy, our slot, he's going to run and try to get a piece of that corner. All right, you just gotta outrun this monster. All right, catch the ball. This is one on one. This is one of our attitude plays. This is just an attitude play. Boom, throw it right now. One on one, get some athletes out there. Make a move and go. All right, he's gotta get off the ball and get to that kid as fast as he can. This kid can do really whatever he wants. And we're out. Everybody else is gonna kind of punch, drive, block, get off the ball quick. So that's Ninja Choice. Now, if this guy is hard, right, he can be uh, on the X, he can be right on him. He's allowed to do that. So we're not gonna run that play there. Uh, we could Ninja Choice, we're gonna run a fade, right? So he's just gonna go, get lit. Well, the cornerback signal it. Because he's going to want to run the, the go route every time, right? So, quarterback will do like a face mask, right, to check. And we'll just every once in a while, the quarterback and other plays has to do that, right? And have the kids have fun with it and do little hand signals here and there. So that's just going to catch and throw. There's no drop. He's going to go back foot to front foot, drop the shoulder. He's going to throw it on his outside shoulder. All right, so it's ninja choice. If he's hard, we'll go deep over top. Now, we're gonna have two other complimentary plays, the ninja that I'm really excited about. Uh, we have ninja go if he's soft. If we run ninja once or twice, right? This guy sees the quarterback flip his hips. He steps back, he shows him his Ws, and then he just goes, right? Same thing, the quarterback, he's gonna pump fake, reset his feet, like the fade, drop the shoulder. And this is big for us last year. We came back and beat Avon, but we tied the game on this play about 20, 25 yard ninja go. So this is easy football. Um, again, this guy's doing the same thing. We're just gonna run that way. <clears throat> and Nasty Ninja. So the ass is gonna be Nasty Ninja. Nasty Ninja, he's gonna run his Ninja. 